The Ambridge Area High School Marching Band has accepted an invitation to perform this fall at an event that will provide its members with a lifetime of memories. And we need your help to make this trip accessible to as many students as possible. Well, Ambridge does have a rich history that spans back uh, about a hundred years and we try and maintain a presence in the community on a regular basis doing parades and events and so forth. And we also like to perform around the Pittsburgh area whenever possible and do parades or other events or even a Steeler game if we get invited. So we kind of, we kind of try and stay as local as possible, but then other times we try and get the students out a little bit further away from Pittsburgh to see a little bit more of the world and go to places such as the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame or um, New Orleans. We went to, to the uh, Sugar Bowl performance there at one point and we always go to Disney every four years to give every student an opportunity to perform at Disney at some point during their four-year high school career. Every now and again we get the opportunity to perform in a more once-in-a-lifetime trip other than the, the, the typical nearby local trips, such as in, two, in 1994, we got invited to France with a small concert band to play for the 50th anniversary of the attack in Normandy. And in 2004, we got invited to Pasadena to perform in the Tournament of Roses Parade and celebrate the Rose Bowl. So those were wonderful, awesome opportunities for the kids. And now our next big opportunity is to travel to Hawaii for the 75th anniversary of the attack on Pearl Harbor. And we'll be doing that in November. So we're gonna to get to go perform at the USS Arizona and the USS Missouri. We'll also perform in the Waikiki Holiday Parade, which is kind of tied in with, that, with the commemoration of the attack on Pearl Harbor as well. So we'll be, we'll be doing a lot of different performances there. We'll get a lot of exposure. The kids will have some great experiences. We'll be performing with about 30 other bands from around the country, but we're the only band from Western Pennsylvania that will be there. So we'll be, we'll be representing Western Pennsylvania a little bit that way. Pearl Harbor being the first time that our nation was attacked by a foreign uh, foreign country uh, was uh, profound for our region as well. We have uh, the second largest uh, veteran population from World War II in our region, in our nation. And when you have an opportunity to talk to some of our vets who were there at Pearl Harbor who served during that time, you really get a handle and understanding of the sacrifice uh, that came into play, whether they were in uh, service at that particular time or they enlisted after uh, and we entered into World War II. I'm looking forward to seeing Pearl Harbor and I always remember seeing it on TV shows and movies and learning about it in school and I was always very interested in the history about the sneak attack on our country and just being able to be in the place where it all happened and standing on the USS Arizona would be a once in a lifetime opportunity. I'm kind of looking to see what it was like to stand there, you know, what happened 75 years ago and uh, see what it was like, you know, be back then whenever it all happened, like the start of the whole war. I look forward to going with my friends to Hawaii because I've never really gotten the chance to go to Hawaii before and spend time learning about the Hawaiian culture and all the cool things we get to do like hike up Diamond Head which will be really cool to see like the beautiful view of Hawaii and just really get to experience the whole culture and new surroundings. Uh, I just think it's going to be an amazing experience to see all the different people there, all the different memorials, to really be in awe of everything that happened there. I'm really excited to get to know the culture a little bit more. Um, I've seen all these movies and stuff about Hawaii. It's just really interesting to go and, I mean, play for, play in Hawaii, and it's just really exciting. Well, I think that our band is known not only throughout the Commonwealth, but throughout the nation uh, for having a rich history of being invited to play uh, overseas in France and being invited to the Rose Bowl and uh, other tournaments throughout our nation and to really get this opportunity to play at Pearl Harbor uh, speaks to the rich history that we have not only with the band but our school district as well and uh, I think that the kids uh, really will feel that impact uh, when they're out in the community telling folks about their trip before asking for money obviously with fundraising opportunities that will present themselves but again after when they come back to tell them about that story about that time that uh, they touched uh, the soil there at Pearl Harbor and met some of the veterans during the parade. Uh, it's a very prestigious parade, only 30 bands, uh, it's my understanding from throughout the nation are invited uh, to participate and it's very, uh, it fills me with pride to know that Ambridge is one of the bands uh, that will have that opportunity.
In order to make this once-in-a-lifetime opportunity financially accessible for as many of our students as possible, we are seeking help from the community. A variety of fundraisers are already underway, with several events planned through the summer months. We hope you'll generously support those efforts. Corporate sponsorships are greatly appreciated. Thank you for your support of the Ambridge Area High School Marching Band as they march toward Hawaii this fall.